morning folks, your boy Brappy here, back at you at attack with another video. Figuring, uh, it's like 9 o'clock, done a few things today, already ate some breakfast and shit. Sort of shitty, well, for the kids. It was snow day, like buses are cancelled, but Carly, she had to show and tell today, so she wanted to go. So since Carly was going to school, I was like, hey, SJ, today's probably a good day to go hand in your project, get some one-on-one -on -one time with the teacher. He didn't like that, but... They're at school, he's at school. So, it's not so bad. Babe's in the shower. Do these up when she gets out. I wanna get some gas today, maybe some carb cleaner or something. I wanna get this carb all cleaned up. Then we can get it back on the riding lawnmower. And hopefully she'll fucking run. I was thinking too though, we might be taking the gas tank off of it because I think the gas tank's all rusty. Might try to hook up a new gas tank on it. We'll figure that all out. First thing I'm gonna do today is try to build a shelf above the TV, nice little corner shelf. So I was thinking that this piece we got right here, if we can get it out, without fucking it up. Might just do the job, I don't know. I don't know, maybe. Got a good old craftsman. Skill saw. So, got a line here. I'm gonna cut it and see if I'm fucking stupid or if it'll work. Well, we got a cut, but I can't remember what side we need, so I guess we'll bring both of them in. Yeah, I like that. Doesn't really go all the way there, but it works. Now I just gotta... Alrighty, so I guess uh, that worked out pretty good. So we'll take the skill saw downstairs, we'll get the drill and some screws, get those brackets screwed into the piece of wood, then we'll get it back up in the corner, screw the brackets in, and shelf is done. Thought it was gonna possibly be a little tricky, but honestly, pretty simple. So this is why they canceled the buses. We got this like freezing rain slash snow coming down. But off to a productive morning though. We got a shelf built above the TV. Then we built another little shelf. Well, we didn't build the shelf. We just hung it up. Little metal shelf. We hung that up in the living room for babe's hockey shit. Now we're going to put our lumber away. And then I got something else to build for. Well, don't really got to build. Just got to fix it. This thing right here, gonna fix it up for by front of the door, 
Carly's got a place to put on her snow pants and sit there and put her boots on. I'll probably use it too, so handy handy. We'll clean it up, fix it up, cut a new piece of wood for the seat. Look at his new. Gotta grab the skill saw again. Talking funny, I got a fucking pencil in my mouth. Trying to fucking get shit done. Snow's coming down. Fucking Jesus Christ. Yeah, this turned out pretty good. Props up. Put stuff in there. Go get a bath. Holy, I'm telling you, the food bank here just fucking spoils us. Crazy amount of shit. This is some garbage. Throw it in the back of the truck. So yeah, we uh, got a nice shelf built. Got other shelf up for babes hockey stuff. And then uh, we fixed that bench nicely by the door. It's looking good. Got all the groceries and shit just put away from the food bank. Now, not too sure what to do. I want to get some gas at some point today so I can start cleaning that friggin' carburetor. Yeah, I don't know. I imagine we'll probably have to go grab the kids here soon. Shortly, I would think. How you doing? Heading back down to the basement. Gonna grab up this other stand. Yeah, babe wanted to use this for possibly a little nightstand for Carly. Probably eventually paint it. Should probably bring my sunglasses inside. Stuff them in the pocket. Yeah, I guess we'll bring this up. Then it's just, you know, something to set her drink on or whatever. Then say if she wants to put a couple toys down in the bottom, she can. So that's pretty cool. Time to go pick up the kids. I guess they're closing the school a little early, so they called us, asked if we'd come pick them up here shortly. So by the time we get there, it'll be a bit after two, like 2.20 or something like that. Lock this up, then hit the road. Well, we just went and got some gas. Took Kate to go get some gas. 
took my empties, traded them in, got some fucking bush, not too bad. So yeah, that was good, we got that bag of fucking empties out of the basement, gone to the beer store, got more beers. Got some gas, and now we can see about letting that carburetor soak in some gas, and then start fucking scrubbing her up and shit. Nifty tits. Woo! What are you doing? <laughs> Yeah, pretty shitty day to be fucking fucking around with this shit. Huh? I said pretty shitty day to be fucking around with this shit. <laughs> Don't fucking wipe out, roads are slippery. It's a little cold, eh? Do I just park it? Bring it to the basement, we'll put it inside. Went for a little boot, bike's inside. Now I can dry off, warm up, and then wait for a nice day. We're definitely gonna get this thing out on the lake this year before it melts. I tell you that much right now. I, on our way home, we saw an ATV out on the lake with the fucking ice hut and shit. So once I get the tracks perfected a bit better on the lawnmower, I already know how I'm gonna do it. I just gotta find the time to do it. I'll take that out there and then the day SJ goes to school and Babe's off to work and I'm all home alone, we'll take his bike out on the lake and have a little bit of fun, do some shit. Fucking raining right now. Sucks. It's not like cold out. Well, it's minus one, but yeah. Drain out. Probably gonna turn to freezing rain. Everything's probably gonna freeze. Just fucking lovely. Oh shit, I was gonna grab a fucking bucket, start taking that carburetor apart. Yeah, fuck. I guess I better do that. And so it begins. So we gotta try cleaning that up a bit. That's what we got out so far though. Yeah.
Yeah, we definitely got quite a bit of shit out of that carburetor. And I don't know, I had it right apart. I cleaned everywhere I could get a little pin into it and whatnot. Had a little nail and a little pin and I was just fucking pinning it in and out and blowing through it and fucking all that good stuff. So I got cleaned out the best I could and I took sandpapered everywhere where it's all shitty. Got it nice and shiny again. Put it all back together so hopefully it's going to be good to go. And then basically... We're going to put it on, but before I hook it up, I want to try to figure out a different gas tank, because you can see all that shit in there, eh? I can't shake it right now, but I'm telling you all, this shit right in the bottom there, that all goes in to the carburetor and just fucks it up. So, this gas tank, maybe tomorrow, is going to come off. Not too sure exactly. I don't think it's going to be too hard. There's not a bolt here, not a bolt here. We'll probably take this threaded rod out. I don't know. Like, we can barely get our finger under it, though, so we might not have to. Either way, we'll have to unbolt it here, get the old gas tank out. And then we'll see what we can't rig up for now. Yeah. 
You, ow, fuck. Ugh, right off the fridge. I'll <laughs> see you tomorrow, folks. Cheers.